How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another live stream. How do we do this? It's so difficult to get back into a live stream after a weekend. It really is. I mean, you got to try and bring back your talkative self. You know, the whole weekend I'm very quiet, and now I just got to go and talk. So, <laughs> oh, I think that that's not good. There you go. Okay, so just checking up. Okay, yeah. So it's very difficult to like get back into the groove of things. <laughs> Anyway, guys, we are, it's come to the end of the month now. And in the beginning of the month, well, somewhere there, I made a video called uh, Scamming Seasonal Server. I explained what we, we're going to be doing. If you guys missed that, basically what's happened, what's going to happen with our servers from now, or at least one of our servers, is that it's going to be a seasonal server. And this last month that we just had is actually castles only. And everyone on the server went and built a bunch of castles and all that good stuff. And now it's come to the end of the month and now we're going to go and judge them. Go and take a look at them and give you guys our opinion on which one we like the most. And then you guys in the chat can all just scream the person's name multiple times in the chat. Whoever just wins at the end of the stream and then the person with the most names wins. They get a $50 Steam gift voucher, or a PayPal if they've got that, if they want that. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna go over the bases. We're gonna try our very best to go through every single base and try not miss any, so... This is gonna be one of those chat nights, uh, not much zombie slaying, but we're gonna go through some really awesome bases. I've, t I've taken a sneak peek of what we're gonna expect tonight, and I'm really, really excited to go and take a look at what we find. Hello, RJ. Sorry, I was a long intro. Hello. How are you doing Hello. today, RJ? You had a good weekend? I'm doing good. Yeah, yeah, I had a very, very decent and awesome weekend. Um, trying to explain to the chest that I'm not streaming tonight. And then yeah. they're thinking, oh, Mr. Reach is not doing the tour. No, 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 I'm doing the tour, oh. of course. i um, doing the tour on my side, and then obviously RJ won't be live streaming that. Because I kind of want to have everybody in my chat tonight, just so we are all here and uh, we can all vote for the people's bases. That's why. Let um, me just change that. I don't think I can actually change that. And it's all gone all foggy. It made my life a whole lot harder. <laughs> uh, so waiting for Arj to join the game and then we can go and take a look around. So, but I have marked a couple of bases around the area. Of which one? I see some other people give me Bradley's Birthday Fun Land. I think I've got that one. Yes. Uh, I've got that one as well. Let's just go um, fetch my fun. Inga's Castle show on map. I haven't seen that so let's mark that down. Hey, okay. So I just got a notepad and she's gonna write down the name of the base and then at the end, well, you guys can decide which one you like the most. So remember the names of the bases you've seen, okay? Awesome. Or we can run a poll on the, uh, the YouTube chats to see. Come on, Weather, what's going on? Let me change, change the, uh, what was it? Set time. What day is it? Uh, 393. 10? Is that gonna work? Did that work? Yes, that worked. Nice. That should change the fog, maybe. How's it going, everybody? It's good to have- How was your- your weekend and all that, guys? I hope you're doing well. I don't want to start without RJ, so I'm waiting for RJ. Oh, She's I'll just let it in. There you go, I invited you. So obviously we're gonna fly around, it's gonna make our lives so much easier. Imagine you have to walk around. Jeez. <laughs> That'll take forever, but this is uh, our first victim here. I'm just okay, waiting for so, RJ. Um... A G F X P P enable. Yeah, let me do that. Sorry, because that's just this is gonna make yeah. life better for me. But you can't is really see it this What's is this? your chat loading tonight? Yeah. Why? It's just quiet. This feels. Is it quiet, or do I just need to refresh? Uh, Marky has said Queen has said something. Peter, uh, Inga. That's all. Okay. All right. So you got the same chat? Yes, I think so. Okay, so this base here, this is made does, by does wizards. Horde, does horde survivability count? No, I not really. I okay. Think it's just the looks of it. So, for instance, uh, okay, so if it has a horde knight base in it, it will get points for it. Yes, but if it's something like this, I don't think this is going to be under the list of castles because this is not a castle. This is a horde knight base. And then there was another one that I saw. Watch out! There's turrets by that one. Um, another one I saw somewhere here that was more for Horde Knight. So, for instance, go... like this now, this year, 
uh, I won't rate and we won't have that on the list. It's just not a thing. But if there's a horde like, inside the castle, then it's fine. Um, right. I think if you go into spectator mode and the turrets won't, the, the, yeah, the, the turrets won't see you. Yeah. RJ, can you please accept my invite? I did. My party invite. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh. Okay, so here is our first one, RJ. This one's made by Wizard. Okay. Ooh. So we, Ooh. what we're going to do is I'm going to rate it by, on our end. So me and RJ are going to be like, okay, we rate it by this. It doesn't mean anything. Obviously, you guys get to vote which one you like the most. But we're going to say, listen, we like this, we don't like this. So don't feel offended. Uh, I'm so, pretty sure like 90% of these bases are better than ours anyway. So. <laughs> it's not um, junk. Wizards. Okay. Yeah. So... Spread a name here. So you can see he's defended him from the zombies. Very nice. And he's got uh, turrets as well. So it is zombie survival, which is great. It's not just an aesthetic castle. Let's walk around a bit. He's got his drawbridge. You want to walk around here, RJ? I don't know. It's fine. I could... Maybe. He's got it all wired up as well. I like the cameras. Yeah. The wiring's um, so a bit messy. Question. Uh, yeah. What's, what's, uh, what's that? What's that? What? Uh, what? I can't see what the blocks are. Yeah, it's it one doesn't of, tell us. Yeah, I'm not sure what. Uh, it's one of those things we've used this before, but he's got uh, like, co corner like towers as round. well. Yeah, I yeah. like these round corners. I'm not good at making round stuff, guys. Really, am not. <clears throat> hard um, supply. This hard is so much better. Yeah, it is just a hard mod. It's just a UI mod. Yeah, a hard it is mod. It's a UI mod. And they got another one. This side's the same. I think it's just like a replica of the other side. We try not yeah, miss not anything mirrored. as well. I'm gonna go inside the main tower. What the spiral staircase and uh, oh. the areas like all open. RJ, come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. C come to the center, yeah. Let me see. He's done well with the uh, the spiral staircases. I think that's. Oh yeah, cool. I like the black. I really do. It fits yeah. well. It goes down. Let me see. Where does this go? This goes probably to bottom floor. Oh yeah, it's just got a little garden here as well. This is actually quite. It's quite decent. I like this one. It's nice. Got us all his forges, like a little. Uh, uh, what would you call it? Like a workshop, blacksmith area. I love the the doors, the door arches. I'm so bad at making door arches, but this is looking great. It's looking really neat. I like that. Yeah. Outside. Oh, it's got a dining room, RJ. You can. Oh, look at these chairs. I like his <laughs> look of these dining areas and these chairs. They look so. The chairs are massive, RJ. That's it's, uh, chairs are for like Minecraft players. <laughs> but the it's table's nice. Minecraft. I like the table. Two players. Hello. Um, please, hello, how's it going? Welcome. And then obviously you got all these stairs all the way around, and yeah. the spiral staircase is a nice touch, and you got a, the center tower, which probably goes, let me go fly through here, it goes up some more as well. Oh, look at this, RJ, sexy bedtime. Ho ho, and tower. <laughs> it's, it's crazy to think it's actually round, when you go inside, it's not round. This is nice, actually, I like this. Roger, where are you? Okay. If you come, um, up, if, if you come up the tower, you'll see what I'm talking about. Try and stick with me. I'm already up the tower, but I'm also I'm trying to tap on a notepad. Oh, okay, okay. So you can see, you got a lovely. I want to rate it according to creativity and. Um, okay, you don't have to go through all that. Overall. Right, all that, you just like write the name down and stuff. You got little windows as well that you can open. Obviously, the chat will get to vote what which one they like the most. So that's okay. And he's got more forges. Jeez, this guy's got a lot of forges. Look at him go. I like the top though. That's cool. You can look down. You can take a sniper rifle and shoot them zombies. Okay, so I think that we've explored most of that. It's actually quite decent. And it, it's another thing that I, I like about bases is it easy to access everything. You see, some bases can, like for instance, having your camp stations here and then your workbenches like this side. It'll kind of irritate me because I have to run back and forth to get to them. Like, for instance, that. I have to go. So that's not too far. I can run. It's not too bad. And some bases are really bad and their stuff is super far away. So I don't really like that in a base. But this is not too bad. Yeah, this is great, wizard. Well done, man. It's looking great. Um, we got under the ground. I got to make sure to go under the ground as well because sometimes I miss, like, basements and stuff that people build. And they're like, Mr. Reach, you missed that. Okay, so I think that's, uh, that one's done, RJ. That's Wizard's Base. You want to mark that down? Yeah, um, if, if you had to score it, where would you put it? Where would I put this under score? I would that's say... What I, was trying to, I was trying to put a score on the notepad, but, yeah. 
Well, I can just look at it and I can kind of tell between the score. I would say 6.5. I think that's a fair one. I think six that's what? Six, six, like what? six, six and a half. One. Six and a half. I think that's a... Uh, out of ten. Out of ten, yes. I think mm -hmm. that's pretty good. Okay. Um, obviously, you know, you got... It's very square, you know. So, yeah, so six and a half. I think that's a decent castle. But it doesn't wow me, but it is It is pretty decent, you know. It, it seems pretty good. Yeah. Oh, but don't get offended by what I say, guys. Seriously, it's not up to me. It's up to the chat. They get to choose who wins, not me. No, no. I just, I just throw my opinion, which is useless anyway. <laughs> do, you get, do you get frame drops on the server? No, no, not at all. I do. Okay, so this is God Killer's base. No, sorry. I'm, it's uh, watch out, RJ. The tower is can Actually, yeah, kill you. you. You have to go into uh, SM mode. Yeah, they won't I'll do that. You. I'll do that. So okay, uh, this is River Dog. Apparently, this is River Dog. Okay. Uh, uh, save waypoints. Uh, great, looking forward to it. Yeah, so at the end of the stream, guys, we'll have a bunch of numbers and you get to vote. You just got to remember which one that we, we mentioned. So, um, this one's very plain. There isn't really much going on. And then this goes all the way to the bottom. It's a, it's a huge mining system. Wow. He's been a busy bee. Look at him go. He's like a little what's ant. That, what's that place called that you're this is River Dog's place. River Dog. It's, it's the guy's name, yeah. So the paint texture, I don't like. Uh, it's not my type of thing. But I like what he was going for in the middle here. The tower's looking pretty decent. If you put some more texture on it, like, you know, little grooves and cuts, I think that would have been even better. Um, Same. Yeah, so guys, if you're just joining on the stream, be sure to hit the like button. It helps out a lot. Uh, dungeon bedroom, yes. Isn't that sexy, right? So you can see he was preparing himself for like a bit of a Horde Knight scenario here. As well. So the functionality for Horde Knight is pretty good, I would say. You know, you can defend yourself pretty well here. Got nice blade traps on both ends as well. And I'm pretty sure the zombies should straight line you from the beginning, from the start there as well. So Horde Knight's great. He's got all the storage on the roof as well and if you go up one let's see what he's got up here he's got his workbench okay so the functionality of getting things like you've got everything in one room that's brilliant i hate it we have to walk so far like i was saying just now so it feels a little squeezed in a box it's a little bit squeezed yes but i like the you know it's easy to access things you know it's great uh create creativity uh, i could use some more for sure but uh, river it. dog river dog yeah Big mine, lots of things going on downstairs, but uh, yeah, so I'll, I'll rate this maybe, um, I would say four. Oh, okay. Uh, four, yeah. It's just that it could use some more uh, design, maybe some more things around, you know, it's just a, basically a Horde Knight base, and obviously I'm not a fan of the, the, the paint texture. Glowy, it's all glowy, but good job, River Dog, it, uh, it's looking pretty good. Uh, this is just a Horde Knight base, and... Here is, I saw this already, I didn't go through it, obviously, let me take this SM1 off. Yeah, thank you, so I could see you on the map. So I'm gonna actually walk this one. This one, this one gets high on me. I saw this from a distance, and I was like, no, this, this looks good from a distance. I really gotta take a look at this. This is made by, um, Tanks? Art and Tex. Yeah, Art and Tex. Uh, she's, she's actually on the chat with us tonight. Yeah. And this is one I really wanted to check out because I saw it and I was like, ah, <laughs> this is going to be good. RJ, come, maybe you should walk with me. Let's walk inside the base okay. in the beginning here. I, I do get train drops. I don't know why. It's so okay. bad. Just come up. This is great. Uh, this is really, it's really, so really great. Creative. It's like it on really the map. It really is, yes. And I, I hate building in mountains because it's so difficult to be creative with it because it's like, wow, yeah. Difficult. Oh, oh, what's a small? Yeah. What is this? It's like a, a church. Seems it feels like a church. Yeah, look at that. That's awesome. So and she then, made a church on the hill. Yeah. <laughs> now you can see what I mean about, like, for instance, um, design and, and being creative. Look what she's done with that. Look how much effort has gone into building that top piece at the very top. That is really good. That is like, um, 
if you've seen my channel that is what's that guy's name oh man uh, 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 vitamin E vitamin E's type of design that up there is how he does things a little workshop oh man this is great Oh, so cute. Love this... it. Oh, she got a swing! It's a oh very, my gosh! It's a very dangerous swing, I might add. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> very dangerous swing. Too. And then she's built these towers. Can you actually go inside these towers? Oh yeah, you can. She made a spiral staircase going to the top. Uh, but somehow it looks unfur unfinished. Uh... I think the wood textures are... Not really? I think the wood texture, yeah, like I'm just saying, maybe that's making it look like it's unfinished, but I think that's intended. It is, it does feel like it's, it's intended because... Yeah, because it's wood, it, yeah. It gives the texture. Oh, this is great. This is really... And I suppose the other tower is about the same. Yep. Now, we're going to save all these bases and put them on our Discord, by the way. So, if you guys want to... Oh, I want to look on the inside. Yeah, so I'm going to go through the door, Andre. I think that's best. Uh, okay. Oh. Um, I, I, well, it's a little kitchen nook yeah, area. Yeah, that's interesting. And then a little fire area. Okay. Can we go upstairs? Book bookshelves. Very nice. It's nice and quaint. Oh, no, I like that. That's cool. What she's done with the, the sink here. Yeah, that, oh that's nice. Gosh. Like a little medieval sink. A, a bath! Is this supposed to be a bath? <laughs> Is this supposed to be a bath? It's that's really very horrible. small. That's a very small bath. You gotta what? Like you gotta go like sideways in the bath like this. <laughs> so. uh, okay, yeah. and then a uh, bit. This is a toilet. Flushy, flushy. There you go. That's great. It's just like Oof. it's got its functionalities in it. You know, you can poo and wee and take a bath and sideways bath, but it works. Uh, and then it goes up. This is very small. But it's kind of cool because even castles in the back in those days they were very much like this. There's a lot of... Wait, is that like all the way down? Where am I here? I'm gonna read a lot quickly, sorry. I, I need to restart my game. I'm so lost. It's okay, RJ, you do that. I'm just gonna figure my way around. Where does this go? That's a dead end. Yeah, there was a few dead ends and stuff. A little bit confused. Uh, let me go right to the top. It's, okay, so you can actually access the walls as well, and you can sit on the towers. Ah, oh, that's nice. I like how she's made it so you can actually, uh, you know, it's got the, uh, what do you call them? You guys can correct me with that. Um, you can go, I'll turn off the oculation because that causes my frames much. to drop to like 10 frames per second. Uh, awesome. Love the, the bath and sink. Uh, some really creative solutions there yeah um, definitely so i'm just trying to figure out my way around there's a little balcony over there so getting around is very difficult but it's it's like it's, it still looks dang cool <laughs> oh she made a little chimney as well look at that man that's so cool that's like that's that's really that looks really cool i wish we still had the smokes uh yeah uh dean exactly like oh. what, the crenellations. Yeah, the crenellations. Okay, let me try. Okay, so we walked in there, and I went down there. So we're supposed to go up this way. Uh, we've got some question marks on the wall. Art, apparently. I like how she's, like, put everything... On. It's, it's, it's looking really good. I'm not going to lie. It's nice. Here's a little balcony. I, I like the balconies. I approve of balconies. Go right to the top. Oh, this is a really nice bedroom, RJ. Where are you at? I'm still logging into the game. Oh, this is this is perfect. This is the perfect. I, this is one of the best bedrooms I've seen. I think it's so cozy. Look at it, and you can take a view of your castle. I, I, I disapprove of the trees, though. What were you thinking with the trees? <laughs> so many trees. She's being undercover. She's hiding. Okay, let me see. Ooh. Oh, what's this? Look here, RJ. She's got a secret. She's got secrets. You can climb up the ladder there, and this takes you to the very top. It's probably just the top tower. Oh man, that's very well done. This looks creative, under, I love under, it. Under the ground, yeah, that's very well done. It's a bit confusing, like downstairs, this is just like a dead end. So, I'm not sure what that was. But, it's very creative. And then you've got all these things on the side, so you can actually try and shoot things from there. 
And the very front, I think that looks really nice as well. The, uh, I can't say it, my mind's blank. But yeah, you did a really good job. I'm gonna give this one an uh, eight. An eight? I think it's an eight, yes. I think it's an eight. It's very high on my list. <laughs> Uh, but I think it's really well done. Um, obviously, I, the cobble and all the paint and then the wood, it does make it look unfinished, like Dante was saying. But other than that, I think it's really done. Eight is really, really, really good. And I think that uh, a little bit more time it would have been even looked ten times better. It's a bit confusing to get around. And the functionality, I think that's a bit difficult to run back and forth. Like, you got your workbenches there, but then you got your storage. I don't know where she was living out of. Doesn't look like she was living here. No. She must have had like oh, a she, tiny I think she was. Stumble. Well, I don't know where her storages are. But yeah, so the functionality is not that great. You got your cooking here, so you got to run back and forth to get around. And I'll get so lost. But eight. Definitely eight. Okay. That's Amy an eight. Lost space. Man, uh, that's, that's great. Well done. Four, ten, six. Well done. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have a, another one. Just down here. I, I fully support tree farms. I fully disapprove of deep tree farms. <laughs> I hate tree farms. They they cause so much lag for some people. Uh, sorry, I'm not reading chats that often. I'm just going through the stuff. Uh, hi, Mr. Reach. I just started a Horde Night Every Night series on my channel, and I only have had the channel for a few days. I upload daily. Okay. Nice place to have snipers helping to defend the walls. So I don't think that another reason what drops the points for that base that we're at, there's no Horde Knight. You could not run a Horde Knight on that. It would probably be really bad if you tried. Uh, uh, so, what in what? Yeah, sure. So yeah, definitely eight. If it had a Horde Knight, a function Horde Knight, then it'll probably be like a nine. So yeah, I guess the, that does make a difference. Now, this guy got a little confused and he went to the wrong party. Bradley. Bradley's bouncy castle. <sighs> How can we rate this one, guys? I said, okay, so when we... I'd say his creativity is like, like... 10 out of 10. <laughs> it is, because it is a jumping castle. It is, yes. But... Yay! Yeah, yes. we can jump. Yes! Bouncy castle. It's not very bouncy, though, RJ. No, it's not. So... But I'd say it's I'd say ten out of ten of creativity, but uh, it's 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 funny because RJ, uh, when we said okay, we're gonna do the castle for castles for this month, uh, we never specified what exactly castle. You could you could have done a sand castle. It was still would have yeah. approved. So yeah, well done. <laughs> wait, wait wait wait! It's a horde not base. Oh, no, oh, no, 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 I think this is just an under- Oh, wow, look at that, you're right. It is ah! a Fortnite base. Ah! Where do they come from, though? They probably drop- They probably drop- Oh, the zombies probably drop down there, I see. Oh. Okay. There's not much to see here. I give us one a five. Or, no, let's say six. I think it's six for being very creative. Yeah. But, uh, obviously, there's nothing to it. <laughs> it's just a bouncy castle. But it's you get just a, a bouncy castle. I love a it. Six for making a bouncy castle. <laughs> <laughs> uh, guys, do the electric fence again? No, oh. Uh, RJ. There you go. Let's hope it's fixed. It's still, still on you. Oh, then I can't fix it, sorry. Okay. Right, so we have floating horde knife. Let me just teleport there. We have another one this side. I saw this one and I was debating if. If I wanted to add this to the list, because it's not a castle, it's a Horde Knight base specifically. But I guess you guys can judge that. It's not It's not a castle. It, it, it is taking some of the style of a castle, but it's not really. If anything, if it were going to be in the castle, it, I would give it a 4. Because that's not castle really. But a Horde Knight, it's like 7. Pretty cool. You can see that it's floating with these things. Very safe base actually. Take a very long time for the zombies to actually hit this. But yeah, it'll be a four wow. if it would be the castle. That looks kind of weird. Uh, is it a Horde Knight base? It, it looked like it was a little bit. Uh, I like that. Well, you like the bouncy castle? That's nice. <laughs> okay. That's a kind of weird of a Horde Knight base, yeah? Yeah, I've seen something like that before. 
on uh, the previous servers. This is can you change the time for me, RJ? I'll try. Uh, okay, so nine. there is three nine nine. There is another Sorry. another thing up there, uh, guys, and I saw it very briefly. I saw it really, really briefly, and if I'm not mistaken, they win by far. But we, I haven't gotten close to it. So let me go up here. Here it is, guys. Look at this thing. What's the name of the base? Or the name? Uh, this, this is Steeds. I think it's Steeds or something. Yeah, so Steed Angus. And he is with somebody as well. I think Shin. Uh, Shin. Chennai. Look at this beauty. This is amazing. Oh, wow. Okay, so they even added a little pathway going down as well. This is crazy. This is like really, really, really well done. This is like... What would you call this? Chinese style of base. I'm going to actually walk through this. Oh, I'm going to start from the bottom here. You still there? Yeah, I'm still here. Okay, I'm going to go actually walk up. Oh, man. This is so looking so good. I'm going to go up the towers. Through here. And you can see you can look down. Oh, man. That's like, that's like the perfect view ever. I'm go through this side. That goes up that way. I want to go through... What's this? Oh, that's the... Oh, you can actually shoot down here as well. Look here, RJ. Oh, wow. Okay. So if there were things coming, you can shoot down. Ladies first. There you go. Okay. Oh, some more path we're going up. Yeah, let's follow this quickly. I want to see where it takes you to. And this is a Japanese castle. Japanese castle, yes. What is Sexy. This, like, the, the, the I like these new wall. things here. What's that? I like the new um, crushinglings, whatever you call them. It reminds me, wall? yeah, so you, do you guys watch a movie called The Great Wall? Reminds me of that. Pretty cool. Is it actually The Great Wall? No, it's just the wall around the place. It's just the wall around the place. I, the walls look really, really good. It looks like the ones like The Great Wall of China. That's how it looks like. It's really, really well done. I'm going to go down back to where we started. I'm going to walk up the stairs, RJ. Okay. Okay, here we go. Really, really well done. How's it going, Padre? How you doing? And Mr. King, how's it going? Oh, and it's a little bit of a horde night base. How is that possible, though? Is oh, it? Oh, is it? Is it really a horde night base? A little bit, yeah. I think it is. It feels like I'm playing another game here, guys. It doesn't feel like it's seven like days to die playing, anymore. It feels like we're playing a trying like that mod. Yeah, the Asian like mod. Yes, Look at Asian this. Mod. What is this? I said, <laughs> this is great. This is like, where do we begin, RJ? They really did well with the staircase, though. Yeah, you look at all the stairs. That's amazing. That's like exactly how I would imagine Japanese type of stuff being. RJ, I'm I, I, be, I, I would, yeah? I'm going to be guessing they were shaping the staircase alongside the mountains. The mountains, yeah. So it gives, so gives it that look. Yeah, for sure. I, I'm going to go uh, into this place here, RJ. I want to see this quickly. Oh man, this the color, the color, and the design is spot on. Oh, have some sushi here. Spot on. It's like hundred percent. It's perfect. It, there's no flaw. It doesn't look messy. It doesn't look out of place. It, look, just look at this. Oh, it, it's like spot it, it feels like on. we are playing a different game right now. It's it's really spot on. This is great. It's kind of hard to rate this, um, it, and we haven't for even me, seen it'll be, holding. Yeah, well, uh, yeah. Well, I, how do you rate? Yeah, it's like how rating rate a whole lot of like individual this? buildings. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is the best thing I've seen so far. Not, not to say that the other people don't do a good job. I mean, we all have our own traits, and you know, obviously. Look, they use the blinds. Yeah, so it's, it's like sideways. Yeah, sideways. Yeah. That's a nice I'm addition. To it. I love it. Obviously, it's like I'm, I, I'm happy to say that these guys, they beat me building castles. Oh yeah, they do, hands down. Oh, We've been creamed. This. RJ. We've been creamed. You can pop grenades down there. I know, it's so good. Man. Super creative. And beds. 
look how nice and neat it looks. It's not overdone as well. Some people, they, they would overdo their things. So they'll put a cupboard there, a cupboard there, some trash there, and a bin there. And it's, it's just... Just curious, just like right? That. What is yeah. everything made out of? I think it's wood, actually. Wood? Yeah. Right, so another, it's another it's seating just area. Cool. I suppose, RJ, if you have sushi and your stomach's getting a bit rowly, you could just like beep, 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 back up here and then just let it, let it rip, RJ. Yeah, I'm pooped down. <laughs> <laughs> Booger. I'm not going to be upset if people vote for this castle. This has got killer. I'm going right up. Oh, there's more. Oh my gosh, there's more. Look at the pillars being used here. It's like they've used every block to their advantage here. Look at this. What is even going on here? Are you sure Vitamin E wasn't here before? Yeah. I'm actually thinking <laughs> about him right now. No, he wasn't here, but this is great. I think Vitamin E will be proud. Sorry guys, I'm not reading the chat too much. I'm just, I've got to focus a little bit tonight. This is... Oh my gosh. We're moving in, yeah? <laughs> We're moving in, yeah? And then you go right to the top. It's like a storage room as well. So they've got the, barrel, the barrels and stuff. I'm actually like curious how the crafting room looks like. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's down. I'm going to go down back where I started. I think that, I th well, let me just see quickly what's underneath. No, nothing underneath. Okay. But I mean, all they had to do, all they had to do is just build that, and that alone gets like an eight, an eight, not a nine. Just that alone. I mean, <laughs> I think we in, you, you got invited to a lowball party, but you brought the best. <laughs> Wait, I need to see this tower. The best oh, thing ever. Tower going up. And well, then? Are, you, are you going to that one? I want to go check it out this. This looks like their crafting station. Oh, little kitchen. It's just a tower. What? what? The There's kitchen. a kitchen in there. Look at the little kitchen, yeah. Oh, how cute. Perfect. Lovely. They, they don't actually use it, do they? Yeah, they do. Look at that. They've got stuff in there. Oh. That's perfect. You don't need anything bigger than that. And then uh, you go down these stairs. Yeah, what's... Okay. So that tower you're looking at, Arja, what's that? This is, this is the farmhouse, apparently, Arja. The tower is just uh, like a staircase going up. There's nothing special. So they were just adding the tower like a... Yeah, a, just to kind of like make it look... Purposes. Yeah, okay. But I'm still going to go check it out. And then they got a little farm down on this side as well. I don't know where to start here or where to go, RJ. So much to go and see. I like the little farm area. I wonder if zombies actually spawn inside, yeah. I'm sure they do. Oh, I'm sure they do. Farm. Oh, cute. Look at this. What's that? It's a little like a pillar with um, sideways blocks. You guys are very creative. <laughs> and I see they use concrete blocks here. Yeah. So that so there has to be a big uh, crafting room somewhere. I'm, I'm sure. looking for it. Yeah. So this side. Oh, look at this! A little river. They got a river. They got a river going through. Yeah, I didn't actually see that. The water in this game sucks, but uh, they did a good job getting the river going. Wow. What's this? Uh, the guard shed, apparently. This is the guard shed with guards stay safe. Okay. Um, got the uh, all the hay here. Very nice. Let's go back this side. So let me just pan over this area, I guess. You can take a look. It looks, this like a, alone it looks like a completely different game. This alone makes a good wallpaper, I'm telling you. It does, yeah. So this is, like you said, it's just a tower going up. I like, it's I like, just a staircase tower going I up. I like how it's all painted as well. Effort, man. Effort. Effort. Oh, you can actually stand up here as well. So there's even a hospital wing. Oh, I'm coming down now. Where do I start? What's this? I like this little shack here. That's cool. A little, they could. Ah. Oh. It's like a little market. Man, market. It's yeah, so it is cute. too. Oh, there's the crafting yeah, area. Yeah, here it is. Workshop. I said uh, the crafting uh, place is in, it's in the open. In the open. Yeah, I like this. I like this a lot. Look at the functionality, guys. Just look at it. Everything is in one place. This is how it should be because. If you have your forges in another wing or another room far away, you gotta run back and forth, back and forth. 
The functionality here, you can stand on one spot and you can access everything. You can access that, you can access that, you can uh, access everything, it's great. I'm guessing, right, if they put everything here all together to start with, right, they probably started here and then they expanded around. Maybe, yeah. The base, because they had to find a place to put the stuff down in order to get the castle going. Yeah. This is... And then they just built around it. This is the Samurai Tower. Oh, hut, RJ, what's this? House. Summer, yeah, summer house. And you can clearly see what things are. This is a sliding door. Sliding door. Yeah. And this is a bed. That's a nice looking bed, RJ. Yeah, it is. Uh, uh, uh bots? Yeah, I go see that. You got bots. Got bots. Uh, supposed to be deleted, actually. It is deleted. By who? By Fly. Fly girl. No, the night bot should have done that. Okay. Go down. What's this? What's this in the back here? They got a little walking bridge here over there. I like. <laughs> look at that. Look at look at how the bridge starts. A little arched. And the bridge is so cool. And you come down the side. What's this little alleyway? What's in here? Oh, nothing. What's what is that? Just the empty room. I think it's the. Oh, you said this was the hospital wing. I like everything's yeah. blue. That makes it feel like it's hospital. So like each house is like a different themed. So yeah. the kitchen is green, this is blue. It's very, 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 very well done. This is excellent. It's going to be very hard for someone to top this. Very, very hard. But it's not about the size. It's about multiple things. It's about how it looks, how it's been designed, how it's painted, how it's it's just it's difficult to judge. But uh, I'm definitely giving this, uh, I would say, nine and a half for sure. I agree. Nine I and a half. Agree. This gets nine and a half for effort and time and creation and functionality and even Horde Night as it seems that they uh, run their Horde Night here as well. It just feels yeah, like they've done it here. So, where does the spikes. zombies actually come in? They must spawn inside the base. And then just make their way through. Yeah. Like, poor thing. Yeah. So, I would say nine, nine and a half for sure. Definitely. Uh, very well Good done. Bird. Hello. That, that's just great. And what is this over here quickly? This is like a little sun deck where they... You know, chillax. Here they are. Take a screenshot. There you go. Oh, lovely. Little goggles. Got beer? No beer. No, no beer. beer. Very no disappointed. Beer. Drop the ratings, RJ. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, the bots are going nuts tonight. It's fine. Moderators will take care of them. Okay. So, that one has been checked. Let me just go on the ground quick, make sure I haven't missed anything. Uh, I hope Nothing on the ground. If I do miss anything, I do apologize. It's very difficult to try <sighs> and catch everything. Look how big it is from underneath. It looks like it's been built on Minecraft and yeah, exported on World of Warcraft. It's massive. Of Warcraft it's massive. It's, it's, a, it's a huge, okay. huge footprint. If you check your map, oh, you look at the footprint. Yeah, I know. Wow. It's just crazy. Wow. Right, so on to the next one. Guys, just ignore the bots. There's nothing you can do about it. It's just an automated bot. If you talk to it, it's not going to do anything. They've got no feelings. It's just bots. Just ignore them. Don't worry about them. This happens to a lot of people. Right. So down the way here, we have... Oh, you give that a rating, RJ? I did, yes. Okay. So I would say nine and a half. Uh, uh, Dancer says night bot works. Okay. Oh, it did actually. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> That's awesome. Night bot, you go, man. You I go. need to see that on Nightbot because I don't... It's Flygirl and Nightbot going. that are going nuts at them. I, I, I need to add words to Nightbot. The more words I add to Nightbot, uh, then it works better. Even if I have to add every word on their language, I'll do it. It's fine. I'm happy with that. Uh, this one's also looking pretty dandy. This one's by Bluebird, RJ. Um, I'm just waiting for you to come down. Yeah, we can take a look at it. Uh, yeah, uh... Bluebird. Ooh. You know, it's, you know what's horrible for Bluebird, right? You know what's really horrible? Is that we just came from a nine and a half rated base and now we buy his. He's probably... <laughs> he's probably so scared about getting rated. <laughs> oh, shame, man. 
But uh, I'm not going to lie, it's not looking too bad, this, either. Oh, he's got a Horde Knight function. Ah, yes, nice. Okay, so let's walk through here. He's got a Horde Knight function. Okay. I like the the clean look of it. Yeah. I like the clean um, look of it. The time he accesses cement mixes, he's probably going to put more. No? Yeah. Workbenches over what here. Is this? It's like a whole maze of a Horde Knight base. I like the Horde Knight base. I think the Horde Knight base is, is really good, actually. I call it the cheese base because it looks like it's made out of cheese. Yeah, it is too. Okay, yeah, it is. He's got a nice table, yeah. It looks like he was still building, to be honest. Because there's a lot of missing features. Like, I mean... It just feels like it was. It's a it's a decent base. It, it's it's quite nice. And then, I like the towers he's done. That's very creative. It's nice yeah. to see some creative towers. He's put some styles on the... Ooh, how, does he, how has he done this? That makes it look... Like it stands out. I love that. Actually, I love that design on the on the tower. Yeah. Oh, wow. You see that? Yeah. Imagine if it was, if it filled up the whole tower, and this is just yeah. the one side. And he's made these make like things that look like spikes. Oh, he's done this side as well with those wavy things. Oh, you're okay. Doing both sides. This okay. is not so bad, oh. Blue. Uh, good job, man. And he's got some sunbathing here. You can relax. Sunbathe, RJ. Got that's very really good. I like that. Alright, so I think I'll rate this a. Yeah, what's RJ's rating? Um, I think a seven. I'm gonna go six. Six. I'm going six. six. And a half. I'm gonna go six. Like six. Okay. I think this is a. I rate this six, Blue. I think it's pretty decent. I do think it is missing some features. You know, it's very plain. Uh, I like the clean look of it, and I love the Horde Knight. Actually. Yeah, six and a half because the Horde Knight base actually was pretty sexy. I kind of like yeah. that one. I think the the Horde Knight base was pretty sexy. It's a six and a half. It actually can push it to seven with the Horde Knight base because I think this Horde Knight base... Alright, so what's the name good. of the base again? Sorry. Bluebird. Yes, you Bluebird. may want to change the time. A good job, mm. Bluebird. Guys, and please don't be def um, offended by our ratings. It really means nothing. I, I have to do it. You know, it's, I'm being honest, and it's just how it is. It is what it is. But so far, it's pretty decent. Okay, so next base, uh, we have, uh, I think, God Killer, and there's another one over that side as well. And then there's Fire Fist this side, Inga's Castle. So I think we'll go down to Fire Fist and then Inga from there okay it's more manageable than the last base y yes so another thing is like is it manageable this is actually looking pretty neat as well so this is fire fist this is fire okay. fist which is also he's also a south african so bear in mind he's done this with a pretty high ping on the server congratulations okay one i can say it looks very clean very neat it's and it's looking yeah, so it's very neat and it's very symmetrical. So it's not like one side is, is is thicker than the other and the one side's off. It's very symmetrical and it's very it's looking very neat and I, I like that. It also makes it nice to defend from Horde Knight as well and it's not too big. So let's go inside. Yeah, I actually kind of like this quite a bit. Uh -uh. I think the um, the red kind of makes it look off. You know, your, your sign, Fire Fist. I think that, you know, I don't like the red on that. But other than that, this is looking pretty neat. I like the windows that they used. Oh, look at this! I love the windows! Oh no, it's so cute! <laughs> I'm, I'm not a fan of these win these things yeah, because this... this I don't like this window here, because it just looks odd. <laughs> I don't know what that looks like. But, um, yeah, I think, you know, like, all this missing area here could have been put to use. You could have flattened it, put some gardens, some pathways. I think that would have made it look so much nicer. And then, you know, obviously you've got things like, like this, you know, you could have flattened it and that, but, uh, towers around, that'd be nice. I like Can't the round towers. Around tower. But then he's done, okay, I suppose it doesn't look too bad. He's done a round tower until the, the wall, and then the wall isn't round. Yeah, I would have smoothed it out with the round tower. Yeah, it probably would have looked better. Um, unless so he added the round tower, like, later. 
It looks like he struggled a bit trying to connect a round tower to a square wall. Look at that. See that? Yeah. Looks like he struggled just a little bit, yeah, to try and connect it. Okay, let's go inside. I like the little garden and... Okay. It's very neat. It's very neat. It's very it's very clean. You know, he's done his paint textures nice. And uh, I'm really liking the way these windows are and the, the way the paint textures mixing in with them. I love the windows. Yeah, I, I do agree with that. I love the windows and I love the paint texture. Hello, Michael. <laughs> how's it going? Look at this. Uh, flip flop. Of how's it going? Ah, flip flop. Uh, oh, this is quite fancy. And yeah, spiral staircase. Yeah. I, I, ooh, this oh, is wow, like that's, wavy staircase. That's that, a wavy staircase. Ooh, that's a new my one. Mind. My oh, mind. This is actually thing. not that bad. Weird. It's very glowy here. It is, too. Uh, this is a, a throne? No. Yes? Maybe? Could be a throne? Could be. And stand here. Oh, hell! Must the reach? Yes. It looks more like an art piece. It does a little bit, yeah. Okay, let's go right to the tip top. Yeah, it's okay. not too bad actually. I think, I think this one for me falls. Okay, it doesn't have a Horde Knight base. It doesn't look like it's Horde Knight compatible, because you can see. Uh, I know Firefist. He he built a Horde Knight base this side. You can see he builds these bases for Horde Knight. So he didn't use that castle as a Horde Knight base. That drops the points a little bit on my side. I'm gonna give it a. I'm gonna look underground quickly. I want to give it a six, Arjo. Oh, there is something. Oh, it's just a tunnel. It goes, uh, so it goes down to his mining section. Yeah, I'll give this a six, RJ. Yeah, me too. I think a six is really good for this one. Uh, no, it's it, you know, there's a few little things like that. It just doesn't look right. Uh, it's very neat. I think it looks very, very neat, and the paint textures he's used combined quite well, nicely, which is why it gives a lot of points to it. And then the windows as well. Big peepee. Yes. <laughs> right. Next. Uh, six. Okay. Awesome. Uh, let's check it. Look at this. I think this is another horde knife base. Yeah, just a horde knife base. Nothing fancy there. Okay. So we have a Inga's castle. The side. Dun 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 dun. And she's in the chat. So and RJ, no funny business here. Just because she sent you sweets doesn't mean you need to score her higher. I know it's fun. There's nothing like that. But, but we might have some competition here. But wow. Wow. We may have some competition. We have competition, yes, we do. This is looking really good, actually. Oh no, don't be biased. It's not me that's voting anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm special arch, I love the content you put out and base tours are awesome. The community has such awesome ideas. It does. Look at this. I love the red. This is mm. this is great. This is like this is good. She oh. went. She didn't go too big, which is very smart because then you can put more detail in a smaller thing. So, oh, look at this. Oh no, this is good. This is very, very, very good. And the little arches and this is excellent. Ah, uh, that's so good. Oh, wait, wait. Did she has to flip the oh. house and turn it into a castle? Uh, I could probably, yeah. Could be. I'm just going to take a look inside. No, no. Man, this is This nice. looked like it was a church. This is really, really good. No, she didn't house flipped anything. No, Inga In like can't it. win again. She wins too many times. She did this instead of coming. <gasps> oh, this is looking so good. No. That's a throne right there. You are not allowed to build like this, Inga. There's a throne. Oh, no, 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 no. This is like really... Inga, you're not allowed to build like this. <laughs> oh, wait, this is the kitchen. This is the kitchen. Oh, this is... Wait, but yeah, this, this is smaller, more like a medieval actually. kitchen. This looks a little bit like one of the ones I made back in the day. Oh, this just goes out. She built a little pit going around. Whatever. And it's yeah. probably trying to, like, for the zombies. So not interfere with the main so house, definitely... so she built the pits around it. I'm going to be saving these bases, guys. And I'm going to do Horde Knights and them for funs. Okay, so... Yeah, so the first horde knight we'll do is the winner's base, obviously, and then the rest of them will come on down later. Oh, that just goes to the throne room. This goes up to this side. Oh, 
All so right. neat. It's so neat and the carpet. Oh, and a little the flags that she's done, the red flags. That's crazy, yeah. This is well, well, this well. This is very well, well done. done. Wait, I want to see the crafting room. I'm looking for that. I cannot find that. Let me see. Just fly around a bit and you can see. Okay, this is looking a little plain up here. It's not too bad, though. Okay. What else? I'm trying to look for like a crafting area. Uh, I don't think not this is here. for Horde Knight. It looks like she's put these turrets. Yeah. Yes, it was meant to turn into a pipe bomb pit base and in, into the well in the middle of the courtyard. Only mm. one tunnel got made in the end. Hmm. Yeah, so uh, definitely we have seen pit bases work pretty well in oh, other bases. There's a crafting station. It's right here. It's a little. Where are you? I'm, I'm inside one of these. Yes. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, functionality. 10 points. Functionality, 10 points. Everything in one room, I approve. I love it. Very nice. Uh, you so if made you go... all of the base with one forge. So you made everything with one forge. I'm guessing everything is made out of wood. Yeah. So, RJ, if you come to the well, mm -hmm. you can see that they were working on some sort of Horde Knight base in the well. I see. Yeah. I see that. So... So they would have made one... Like, all four pops going into the well, but only able to make one so far. Yeah. Alright. So, that's well done. I think the the the, the, the Horde Knight functionality mm, might drop your point or two, I think, on my end. Obviously, that doesn't matter, because at the end, it'll be up to the viewers to vote. Please stick around for that, guys. We need some voters. Uh, so, keep an eye out for that. Uh, we do need some voters. I don't want to have nobody voting because otherwise it's going to be bad. The Nightbot is kicking uh, the bot's ass, RJ. Okay. So that Nightbot is kicking the bot's ass. Fire with fire. We're fighting bots with bots. This, what, what does our world come to? Uh, but yeah, Inga, that is excellent. And then there's the clock in the middle. Oh my goodness. They managed to add a clock. I wish it was like Moving, working. yeah. Imagine if it was working. I think that would be cool. It would have been nice. And then ding, ding, Fortnite starts in at 10 o'clock. Right, I'm giving this... A... an 8. 8? No, 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 I, I, not for me. It won't be an 8 on me. Okay. For me, it will be just like one point below... No, it... I think I'm going to give it exactly the same rating as the other one. What, 9.5? Yeah. Uh, what? Because that one that we saw is a Chinese market castle, and this one is a, a medieval... Well, this one's smaller, castle. yes, but it's got so much detail in it, and they're very, very, very well both done. You know, it's, it's, it's very difficult to have the one higher than the other. I think this is excellent. I think that... I agree. If, if that... Those people up there built this one, and she built that one, it would still be the same, because... It's like the same design style, and it's just... I don't know, I'm giving this the same rating as the Chinese one. So it's between Sorry. those two on my, on my opinion. 9.5. Yeah, this is a 9.5 for me. Maybe I'm being biased because Inga's like a friend, but I, I really think this is good. I really think this is good. Overall look of it, I can't... Ooh, this nice back area. Yeah. Yes, overall look... I'm impressed. I love this design. Looks clean, yeah. It looks very really clean. Okay, on to the next one. You want to change the sound? We're walking into Horde, Horde Night here. See, I told you, yeah, Inga, be cool if the if the clock moved. Yeah, it would be cool if it, if it did. Yeah. Just change so, the sound, RJ. And then yeah. I'm gonna go to. Um, is this another one that's been shared by me now? No, those are just airdrops. Why did that? Okay. So we're going on to God Killer's base up here in the desert, and we're going to take a look at what we got. Yeah, uh, I yeah. did fly over this one a while ago. Just and... wait for me, please. Yeah, I'm not going to go in the. I'm waiting for you here. Yeah? I can see you. I think this is God Killer here. Yeah, I'll wait for you, RJ. No problem. 
Because yeah. I'm doing like, like three things at once as well. Uh, I reported the bot and blocked it. Yeah, you can report the, the the bot, guys, if you want to. I'm pretty sure at some point something will happen. Uh, but however, um, if you block them, it doesn't actually work. Because I've blocked the bots as well, and they just come back. They seem to get around that. Okay, right, so this so is God Killer plus FG. I don't know what that is. Fly girl, maybe. Fly girl, okay. Maybe. Uh, save waypoint. God. Uh, fly girl. Okay, so, first of all, I like the walls. I like the way it looks. The tower looks a bit strange. Doesn't look too bad. Uh, the one thing that spotted oh, my oh. eye... I would have loved to see the overhang on the The roofs. tower. Yeah, yes. there's no overhang. So that there's kind no of... Overhang. For me, yeah, that makes it look a bit strange. Um, the one thing that I spotted... And you know, castles always like... You know, it's medieval times, and it just... The road is a bit strange for me. I thought that, you know, it would have been better if it was gravel instead. That way, because, you know, there were never roads like like uh, asphalt roads in the medieval times. They so, probably had motorbikes here. It's yeah, so it's okay. And then, obviously, this doesn't... This looks a bit strange. But... I like the I like the way the house looks, and I like the little balcony on the outside as well. I think that's freaking cool, and the windows and all that. Yeah, and, and the uh, plants, crafting plants area. And then they've got this oh, side pillar that goes up the side. Very nice. Okay, so now I'm gonna walk. I'm gonna walk inside. Uh, oh wow! Okay, the roof has got some heavy design in it. Roof, yeah. Look at that. It's got those. Pillars that goes across it. Yeah, I like the roof. That's some nice right. design. It's nice to have, like, instead of having it all flat, it's nice to have proper design. Mm. Like, you know, uh, blocks and stuff on the way. This is a throne room. Uh, I'm looking for staircase going in. Wow. Yeah, going, uh, staircase going up. up Elevated go. airship in the making. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, so like I was saying just now, I love this little outdoor area. Little farm, and you got a very nice view from here. So Greg says here, Jawudo wishes that the clock tower bells actually rang and moved as well. It, I agree with both the clock hands Ooh. moving and the bell ring ideas, as it would help a lot. Yeah, so imagine like a uh, hold night or something. Ding, 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 ding. I think that would be pretty cool. Oh, Jay, I love the way they've done this. The Can you see where um, you are? the fireplace. Oh wow! I think that's done oh, yes. nicely. That's very, that's done very, very nicely. And then, and then it just added the paint, the paint textures. Yeah. Onto... Right. Very, very. I love that. That's gonna give you a, a point or two for sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. This just doesn't You're look that bad. You're gonna steal that idea a bit. Uh, I don't like the windows. I'm sorry. They've used the I'm, block as a window. I'm like uh, interesting though. Yeah, I'm not a fan of those. I, I like to have um, some, what do you call it, some uh, some space in the middle. So it looks like an actual window. This looks like a Minecraft window. So I don't know yeah. if I like that too much. Uh, uh, do you think that to be truly get rid of the bots, is uh, it still be there? What's that? Uh, maybe they will get investigated if seen. Maybe YouTube will... Take the bots more seriously if they know what the bots look no, like. No, I think I think YouTube knows very well about the bots. It's just that they just keep coming back. There is literally no way. I mean, those bots you see, it looks like they have the same name, but they don't really have the same name. They've got like an extra dot or a, a a Y instead of a Z. And then, I mean, this one's about F Tinder. Uh, the other one wasn't about Tinder. It was about something else. So they have different names and stuff. They just have like, because if the first one doesn't work anymore, then they go they to, go the, to next the next one. one. Yeah, they sort of have like millions of accounts that they just use. So the YouTube bans, YouTube bans, it's just, they just keep coming back. So I don't know what this room is, RJ. What's this, what is this? It like more like, like a, a bedroom. TV. Okay. It feels more like a bedroom. I mean, there's the beds right oh, here. I see. Okay, that's uh, a very big pillow. Was, Jeez. This was meant to be like the cupboard or bathroom, not uh, sure. It goes up here, RJ. Oh, it goes up. Yeah. I didn't see the ladder. A lot um, of, wow, there's a lot of pot plants. It is. Oh, it's a bit confusing. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, little dining room. That's, that? That, that looks pretty decent. 
Oh, Aja, I don't know about the cupboards, though. Yeah, they look very... This one's skew. They slanted. What's going on here? All of them are. Oh, that drove me crazy, RJ. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I like that. <laughs> Here's the crafting room. Points to that because... Oh, yeah, functionality. Definitely. Yeah, that's that's great. It looks nice. I think that looks pretty good. Yeah, it's not too bad. Well done, God Killer and Fly Girl. Very nice. Could have used some more detail on the outside, maybe. Uh, overhangs. Yeah. But other than that, it looks pretty decent. I'm going to give this one a 5, RJ. Or... Yeah, I think this one's five. I think based on what they did with the stove, right? The, the, the fire coming out of the stove, I'm going to give it a six. You're going to give it a six, eh? Thank you for the subscribe, I appreciate Thank it. You definitely scored some points there. It's, it's right this? there. Oh, we missed something, yeah? We missed the tower, yeah? Okay. Okay, right. And the tower. I'm going to give it, I'm gonna give it a five. Room. Yeah. Okay, not too bad. Okay, on to the next oh. one. You're gonna, you, you've, you've tagged it down, RJ. Yes, I did. Um, uh, how's it crazy, Wolf? How's it going? So this one is... The one on your thumbnail. Yeah, so this is the one on my thumbnail that you guys saw. I don't see a name anywhere. You, you see a name anywhere, RJ? Well, oh, someone yeah. on Discord yeah. did he has mention... A name, RJ. There you go. This side, by me. The... Yeah, so... Matthews. I'm going to write right. that down. Matthews. Okay, so this one looks very unfinished to me. I think this one seems very unfinished. It feels like it's missing a lot of features. And I, it's going to be difficult to rate something that's not really finished. But let's go inside and see. Maybe we'll be judging a book by its cover. Uh, oh, yeah, for sure. Five. I like what he was going for, for sure. I mean, look at that. I love that, actually. You jump up like this and you can shoot out. That's that's freaking awesome. Big garage. What is this? This is supposed to be Horde Night, aren't Jay? Zombies come up here. This yeah. is supposedly a Horde Night base. Yeah, look at that. Zombies come up here. Ah. Okay. Okay. Not bad. Not the detail. Okay, I see. Yeah, it seems very unfinished though. And he's got his little crafting station here as well. I approve of it because functionality, it's all yeah, together. Yeah, all together, yeah. And you can see if you jump up here, like you can take a look what's going on outside. I think that's pretty cool. Yeah, but it's still very unfinished, I think. Let's go under the ground. Mm -mm, nothing. Nothing. I'm going to give this one a four, Jay. Alright. Just because it's unfinished. I think it was going very well. Um, see, like, why is there a single window there and not a window this side? It drove me absolute nuts. You know? It's like yes, he wanted, it's a peeping Tom. Oh, because he wanted um, to see the horde or something. I don't know. I, I think um, if there was a window over here, that it wouldn't have made any difference. Or you think it would? I think because it would make it look a little bit better, but it wouldn't map. change the rating. <laughs> I think it's a four. What do you guys think? I think it's a four. At least, did I say five or four? Did I say five or four? You said four. Four, yeah. So I'm going to go for four, for sure. Four, for sure. But yeah, we currently have 77 people watching and 47 likes on the stream. Guys, thank you so much. So this is where it gets difficult now because I don't know where any other bases are, RJ. Yeah. Now we just need to so go. So now we got to be searching unless... These well, I've already marked now. the bases on the map, so it's just a matter of going around and see where it's different. Yeah, so this is going to be a bit of a challenge. If people on the server, if yeah, so if I told them they're going to give me all, all, the older bases, uh, four board twenty-five. That's very specific. <laughs> yeah, falls fair. Yeah, it was going somewhere for sure. I, I, not, not like I'm saying it's bad and everything. There's something going on over here. What's this? This looks like a mine. So we're going to be doing a lot of flying around now, just look for places. It's going to be a little bit difficult. They hacked attempt accounts, great. And click. Oh, oh no, the coffee's wearing off. 
uh, created and deleted within minutes. Yeah, so that's what actually happens. They just go and create and delete things. So there's another one. Another mine. They love the mines. Some people really like mining in this game. Do you guys like mining in this game? Some people say they love it. Some people, they put uh, their TV series on or their movie and stuff and then they, they mine while they do that. I don't know why the Horde Knight stuff is going off like this when it's only 12 in the day. It's going to be really hard to go and search for castles in the uh, the wasteland. I hope no one's built in there. It's going to make my life a whole lot harder. I, I, I actually moved to the forest area. Yeah, I'm looking around here in the desert. Uh, if anyone's watching the stream that's on the server, just let me know if you know any base that I've missed, please. Uh, Inga says, you've shown all the ones that I'm aware of. Okay, so that's good, but I'm still going to search around just to make sure, otherwise they get that comment, YOU MISSED MY BASE, HOW DARE YOU? It's going to be very difficult. But I think next time we'll have everybody to give us coordinates prior. So when they've settled, they've got to put their coordinates down. Uh, I am looking around, hoping to see something. Yeah. So right now it's between um, Inga and the J Japan castle. Oh. Oh, it's been a long weekend, everybody. You slept enough today. Mm, no, not really. I look at this city. Yeah, it like ends like right there. Okay, I'm not seeing anything in this area. To be fair, not many have been on and made castles, which you have... Uh, you've pretty much seen them all. I'm still gonna look, just to make sure. We have to make sure... Um, because I, there's always something I miss when I go and explore. And yeah. I've also marked them down on my map, just in case. That I don't go to the areas where I've already looked, so I'm looking in, like, in the open. Yeah, same, but uh, most people, they stick around on, uh, stick around the traders. Um, Steed, uh, Japanese castle, yeah, so it's between Inga and Steed and Shin. So, so. I think I found another one. Unless you've re-rated this one. Let me see on the map. Oh, yes, one. yes, you did. Yeah, we have. Yeah. I haven't marked it. Though. Yeah, it's going to be difficult. But I appreciate the people who came on and gave me markers because that helped out so much with the markers. I just went straight to them. But I'm very, very impressed with what, what you guys have done so far. Very happy about it. I'm interested to see the next season as well as a random campfire. How dare you leave those around? Leave it cluttered. I'm just messing, it's fine, it doesn't matter. I we think also that, leave uh, random campfires behind just to bring a horde in and fire to get experience. Yeah. So this this is Fire's one. I don't know if he had friends here nearby. Let's see. Uh, so here was something someone was making, but it uh, obviously didn't go very far. I'll give that a one. <laughs> I'll give you a one, man. <laughs> But I mean, clearly, I mean, we haven't restarted, but looks like you were going somewhere with it. Uh, what's this over here? It looks like people, a lot of people were trying to build things here. I think what they did was they were just trying to get something started, simple to yeah. start. And, and then build on for they, that. Yeah. Oh, look and at this. On to, like elsewhere. This guy has a, a wonky floor, RJ. He was digging down. I wonder what he was doing he was. here. Are we digging iron? Uh, Peters, I think the Asia theme is clear window for me. Well, at, well, just now when we ask for the people to shout and go nuts, we'll let everybody do a vote. We'll do a run a poll on, uh, oh. yeah, on YouTube and you guys can vote. And the winner, again, will receive a $50 Steam gift voucher or a PayPal. And they get to choose what next month's challenge is going to be. Obviously, it has to be specific. It can't be like, you know, everyone house flip a house because then that's going to be done within like a week. It's got to be something a little bit challenging. 
I've got a couple of ideas as well, but... Can we not say it? It has to be the winner. Besides, I'm the one who decided to do castles. <clears throat> right? Or was it your idea? No, I, I don't know. I think castles was a no-brainer, RJ. But yeah, I'm not seeing anything in the area. Besides, I'm finding anything else either. I think that uh, the people that were actually... Um, who built castles should have been on tonight to let us know. But I think that we're going to do the vote. I don't see anything else. And if I have missed something, I do apologize. I do apologize a lot. But I don't want to sit and explore for nothing. Oh, some trees here. What's going on here? And something. No. Nah. It, just uh, it's just it's probably just the tree farm that they built so they could use the wood to build. Yeah. Right, guys. So, now we're going to get to vote for the basis. I think that we've covered majority of them. It's a little bit of a sad turnout. Not that much basis. I was expecting a little bit more, but I'm happy with what we've seen so far. Right, so let's start writing them down in a poll. So, RJ, if you could please give me the names. Maybe you could just copy it to me and we can get a poll going. Okay, well, uh, let me copy it to you on this cord. So, okay, so RJ, Thanks. a poll's not going to really work. Why not? Because you can't do anything. It's a yes or no. Uh, what? So, there's no... No. So, the polls on YouTube's a yes or no. That's stupid. You can't change it. No. What, a, what about a, a straw poll that you just post on you, no, the YouTube link? You can try that, but... Uh... A, straw, a, a straw poll can... or may work. Mm. Okay, you can do that now. Just set it up. Alright. Uh, hello, Mr. Reach. Hello, bedrock bases. Bedrock bases? Uh, if that's what the... Th yeah, so, uh, not for us to pick. It'll be for the winner to pick. What's, the, what's this? It's just a Horde Knight base. Yeah, what about so making custom... Uh, Great, like, like we said, it's not for us to uh, pick, it's the winner to pick. Yeah, so the winner can decide, and I don't want to mention anything. A poll on Discord, well, on but Discord? no one goes on Discord, that's the thing. And uh, the poll's going to be posted on the chat here. Right, so... Yeah, so RJ is setting it up now, the, the, the poll. And then we'll put it on the chat, so you just click on the link and go and vote for the base that you think that should win. Uh, you, can if, uh, you can vote for your own base if you think you want your own base to win, that's fine. But you can only vote once, and then the vote won't last long. It'll be three minutes, four minutes after that. Then uh, we will go ahead and announce the winner. But yeah, I think this base here would do better without the trees. I think that uh, uh, kind of hiding the base's detail with the trees. Do you guys understand what I'm trying to say? It's like you're trying to hide some of the, the bits of the castle that you don't want seen. I think that your castle is kind of pretty and looks nice on the hill and you want it to be seen, so remove the the trees a bit. Uh, so, Steed, Insignia, um, Japanese Yeah, but you got to do all, all of them that we've rated today, so they can all vote. All of them that we've rated. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Is it? River dogs. So guys, we currently are at um, 73 people watching and 60 likes. Thanks for the likes, guys. Appreciate it. Yeah, likes are doing doing great, guys. Thank you for the likes. Um, yeah, it's going great, guys. 
it, it won't be a long stream tonight, just simply because there's not much to... I well, know it was supposed to be a little bit longer, but uh, there's not many more bases to go around and see. What's this? Oh, it's another one of those mines. Looks so like you want to put everyone's side. names on the poll, not the, not the top two? Yeah, of course, because we, we said the top two. You know, everyone's got to choose who they want to vote for, even if it's like someone else. That's okay. So I'm just going to put all the names down, you guys can vote. But stick around with us, guys. We need voters. We really need voters. If you've been watching the stream from the beginning, we need the voters. Hey, the Nightbot is doing a brilliant job. It's super quick as well. Uh. Because I only got the names on. I think that, you know, I think a lot more work has gone into this one than Inga's one. I think a lot of time and effort has gone into this one. And like I said, I'm definitely going to save the bases. People have gone and they've done a, a, a hard job. Of doing these bases and they deserve to keep them you know i'm not gonna we're gonna be wiping the server on the first uh, and then start the next challenge of course but um uh, these bases will be saved and i think we'll try and save the whole world if i just up to doing that as well um allow multiple choices as in no so only one person oh. can vote you can't vote for okay multiple yeah. But yeah, just taking consideration, guys. Taking consideration this one, taking consideration of Inga's one, taking consideration of everybody's bases, and you can make a decision on your own. And whoever makes the decision wins, guys. That's it. I mean, this one's... I don't know, it's on par with the Japanese one. Obviously, it's smaller, so a lot less work has gone into it, but it's still okay. got a, just uh, as I'm much I'm going to post it right over here. Stropal and stuff. You make okay. sure you've got everyone's bases, aren't you? Yes. Okay. Uh, there, there's only one person's name that I don't have on there because he didn't give it to me. Oh, who? The one that's like floating. Oh, no. Leave that floating one out. I think the well with the Horde Knight would have been pretty cool. It would, yeah. I would love to see it. Yeah. Okay. Did you post it, Andre? Okay. I did. All right. So, guys, I'm pinning that in the chat. The pin chat. There is a stroll poll to go and vote. Please vote for your favorite base that you've seen tonight, if you've been watching from the beginning. And let me know uh, which it's one It's the live results on there, too. It's live, so you could actually see it. Yeah. So, I'm watching the live. You guys want to see the live results? Let's just try and get the screen capture. Uh, just give me a minute, guys. Uh, dang it. I don't do well under pressure. Clear. Window capture. Okay. Oh, that's not the one I want to show you. Hang on. Guys, there you go. There is the... The stroll poll so far. So, so far, Steed and Shin is winning uh, by eight points. Inga's got three points and Godkiller has three uh, art, art, art tanks. Even the bouncing castles one. is actually getting <laughs> the bouncing <something>. castle. <laughs> it's very creative. Even I wouldn't have thought about making a bouncing castle. Yeah, for sure. Greg says, yeah, I do not know what kind of options are in those in the pool to select from interesting, at least. Well, for me, it's very difficult for me to decide between Inga and Steed uh, and Shin because they've done, they've both done a really good job. So there's 10 points on Shin and 
six on Inga so far. How do I go into this? You should be able to just click on the link, Inga. That's pinned. And then you should be able to just vote on it. It's not really needed to. So there's seven on Inga so far. Uh, but I, I think that all of you guys have done a really good job. Wizard, Riverdog, uh, God Killer and Fly, uh, Bradley, funny. <laughs> uh, Fire Fist, you know, all of you guys have done a, a pretty decent job at building these castles. And I really appreciate that you've gone ahead and done this. Look at, look at that. So there's 7 on Inga and 11 on the Japanese castle. So we'll give it a couple of more minutes. So yeah guys, remember, if you're just joining in, go ahead and vote. We've, so far we have 25 votes. There is a pinned comment in the chat where you can vote on the basis that you like the most. So what we'll do is we'll hop on the game a bit. Uh, Greg says, I was just wondering if I should just select the bouncing castle and see what happens. <laughs> uh, at, least, at least you got a point to tell you that. You still got a point. You see, uh, uh, Twitch has a poll option where it's not just yes or no, but it, there's like yeah. multiple selections. So for sure, I just wish YouTube has a, yeah, it's just a yes or no. You can add a, a third option, but that's it. Or you can add a fourth option, but that's it. You know, it's not going to be yes. enough. That that would have been nice. Wait, where is the one BTC and one two BTC? BTC? That's Bitcoin. Ugh. Not sure what you mean there, uh, uh, X Factor. X Factor, no idea what you're talking about. I mean, just look at the, the very, very, very tip top. You know, you must remember they had to actually stand up here and manually place these blocks down. Blop, blop, like that. And then they have to walk down, manually place these blocks down, and then go all the way down. Mm -hmm. It's like, yeah. This is some dedication right here. Hey? Definitely, yeah. Manually place every single block down. You know how much work that takes and how much time that takes. I remember we built a castle or a fortress, that massive fortress that took us three weeks to complete. All right, let's check on the uh, voting, guys. What are we at? What are we at? Let's see. Okay, we have 14 for um, Steve the Japanese and Shin, castle. The Japanese castle, and, and 7 on Inga. So, so far, by the looks of it, looks like the Japanese castle has won. Nothing, just a meme on YouTube. It's a crypto scam. Well, if it's a scam, then why even bring it up on my stream? I'm kind of glad I won't have to pick the next challenge. <laughs> I think, uh, <laughs> yeah, so I think it is official, guys. I think that uh, Steed and them have won the challenge. Well By done. majority. <laughs> By majority, yes. So, well done, Steed. You've done a really good job. Now you've got 15 votes. Thank you so much for taking part in this. That's great. Um, obviously, I'm going to be saving these bases as well. And if we're gonna do a horde night on this one, we will be doing horde night on the bases as videos for you guys to take a look at. But well done, congratulations, you've deserved it. And Inga, I, I think you also did a really good job with yours, and uh, and everyone else who put some time and dedication into some of their bases. Uh, it's been awesome taking a look and getting some inspiration from you guys. It's always awesome. Um, but yeah. You can see they were building a road as well, but they never had enough time to finish that off. But well done, everybody. Well done to the winners. These are the winners. Take a screenshot. They won. And they've even got a nice place to celebrate it as well. The bar. So. Oh, yeah. At the bar. They're probably <laughs> drinking as well as we speak. At the bar. <laughs> yeah, so definitely, I think the vote was fair. Uh, even if they chose Inga as well, I think that also would have been fair because they both did really good jobs on their, their consoles. What's the new season? Well, I think it's to ask them. Let's see if they can give us an answer. Bobby, thank you so much for a $5 super chat. Thanks, Bobby. You're our first donation tonight. Awesome. Uh, Steed. 
And Shin, what's the next month's challenge? See if they can give us an answer tonight. They don't have to give us an answer. If they don't have one, it's perfectly fine. They can give us tomorrow. Some, something like a good challenge. It has to be a good one. I don't know if they're going to answer me. Uh, but yeah, it's been so much fun. Brad, Brad, Brad in the chat. Are you, are you responsible for the bouncy castle? Uh, is, is, are you the same Brad? Brad? Are you, are you a chat, Brad? <laughs> I think they're thinking about it. I can always ask them after and then I'll alert the Patreons. In the Patreon chat, get you guys to know. But yeah, I think we are done for tonight, guys. I know it's been a short stream, but uh, it's a good start to the week. We've got some pretty cool stuff coming this week, guys. Really, we do. We plan on playing the Asia mod, the Asia mod for Seven Days to Die. And we're trying to bring back the game Scum. Modern House Flipper. Uh, exactly what I didn't want them to pick. They picked it. Okay. It has been done before, so can we give it a twist? Yeah, what's a twist? Because uh, House Flipper, in general, has been done before. Yeah, what's the twist? Modern, so we need a twist. Oh. What's the twist? Oh, I thought you had a twist. Scale? <laughs> I, I don't know, it's not a good place to talk about it, RJ. But uh, we'll right. discuss it so more. We'll I'll, I'll go to them school. directly and um, go and ask them what they want. A house flipper, like I said earlier, it's a bit difficult to do a house flipper because it takes not long to do a house flip. I mean, if you go to a house, for instance, uh, it's got to be a month challenge, you got to remember. So if you gave me a, a house flip on this specific house, this is going to take me a week or two weeks. And then I'm done. And then what do I do? And then it's like, it's it's very it's very difficult. Uh, and then you've got to have everyone do the same house up in the same town. So it's very difficult to do a house flip challenge for a server event for a whole month. It's, it's got to be a little bit bigger than that. But uh, I'll speak to them and see what we can come up with. And I'll let the patrons know. Again, guys, if you want to take part in the next server event, which will be season two. Don't know what it will be yet, but I'll let you know. Uh, it's probably going to gonna be, gonna start uh, at the Patreon. first of June. The 1st of June, yes, it'll start. Yes, 1st of June. You have to be a Patreon or member to join our server. And you can come and come and join it and be part of the challenge. More people, the better. Uh, I am the Bouncy Council Master. Barbecue and be at my place. <laughs> <laughs> lovely. So he is the person who actually made the Bouncy Castle. Yes, he is. Uh, lovely. Right, guys, we'll see you in the next stream. We'll probably be streaming another, another two more times this week because we have that uh, scum thing we want to do. And then we've also got that uh, Asia mod that we want to do as well. So it's going to be a jam-packed full week for you guys. It's just tonight that uh, it's a bit slow. Right, guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll check you in the next one. Uh, Steve, Bye, everyone. Steve, yeah. and, Steve and Shin will get their $50 as well. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye, everyone.